What's up guys? So I am about to do the, well, I don't know if it's the, the, the wrong thing to do or, um, but as you know, um, I crashed, well I didn't crash, I tipped over um, Black Maddie last year um, again and so she got some pretty significant you know, damage on the, uh, the actual bag so it scraped up so today I'm going to be fixing that in all the wrong ways. What have I done? Yeah, it's not terrible. Alright, so as this thing is drying, I'm like thinking all the horrible things that could go wrong here. But it doesn't look too bad actually. I don't know if the video is showing. There's still the outline. You can see the outline. But it is uh it's not bad. Well, I don't know. It, it definitely isn't shiny. <laughs> I didn't put clear coat on it. Um, the little patch that I did that had clear coat on it looked a little thick and, and bubbly. But I guess so does this. Um, it's, it's not too bad though. I mean it's better than huge scratches. Um, but you know there's some scuff still here. I think it came out pretty meh. Anyways. That was my terrible idea, guys. Um, don't try this at home. I don't know. It might be worth it. I mean, if you had a lot more damage. I didn't do anything for the scrapes. They're just dug in. So, anyways. This is my addition of what not to do. <laughs> oh, come on, guys. You know I'm not going to leave it like this. Are you kidding me? Anyways, just wanted to play around a little bit. Um, it's, I guess, it, you know, if you had a really bashed up case, then that would have been you know something to make it darker black again at least and you know kind of take away the white and all that but uh nah i can't do this um so what we are going to be doing um what happened was <laughs> i was actually uh saying about you know what i was doing i'm gonna be honest this was gonna be it but um i told my brother about it and you know he got curious like hey uh you know send me a picture what are you doing to it and i'm just like man i'm spraying it with spray cans and this and that and now my brother is a painter has been a painter for years um, worked within the car industry for for a long time so he knows paint in and out so um, he was cringing of course uh, so I told him I sent him a picture and everything and uh, he has had mercy on me and told me to go ahead and uh, come on out and he's going to fix it so we're gonna try to do something better than this I can't get this off I just realized that this model <clears throat> and if you own one of these you may want to know this that some of them had Allen um, bits here that you could just uh, take these off. These are rivets. You'd have to drill these out just to get this cover off, which sucks. So I'm packing this big old thing on the back here. Um, and we're going to get it out to my brothers and uh, see what he could do. Oh. oh, that is shady. But hey, let's make it happen. Jeff finally made it. Turn that demonetizing music on. They're gone. America, man, America. What did that come off of? Uh, it's brand new. They're going that little black truck. Oh, so this is, what is this, uh, 96? 94 S10. 94 S10. This is this is the one he just got done painting, hey. and he's gonna use the same paint to do mine. So mine has I have just a little bit of tiny bit of sparkle to mine, the the original factory, but um, this doesn't. But I don't think it's gonna make much of a difference. So we're gonna see, you know, if uh, you know if it makes much of a difference i don't think it's gonna so i think just the it's gonna be better than what it looks right now so um yeah this is the project he just got done little s10 
it's kind of dusty because of this parking lot but uh he does some good work and this is you know just out of this garage and that's a doggy what you doing doggy? <laughs> During the weekend, I'll sand that down, get it in primer. Say hello to YouTube. Hi to YouTube. So what's the thinking behind taping it first before you paint it? You gotta tape it off when you paint, right? With this. Well, but. I wasn't brave enough to paint it all. Like I, all the scratches were like in this area, so all I did was outline just the very edge of what was damaged and tried no, to leave thought, as much original you as thought possible. When you unmasked it, you weren't going to see that line at all. I, I thought <laughs> magic was going to happen. <laughs> I, think that's what, I think that's what people think. <laughs> I, I, I was just going to say I'm just curious. I was going to polish it. Ten times, ten times a week. <laughs> I was going to polish it, you know, put some, um, you know, turtle wax, yeah. and that would have been fine, I guess. Yeah. So. It wouldn't have been. <laughs> all right, so, as you can hear, we're getting the air compressor together. Yeah. Yeah, that was a deep one right there. Yeah, I got to mix up some putty I'll put in there to fill that before and I primer. The ones on the top, you can barely even tell it was scratched. Most of them are gone. Yeah, the oh, primer wow. I'll fill that. It's smooth. All right, so we got it sanded down. Um, we um, are going, he's, he is going to uh, continue to work on it. Uh, we're going to get some putty. We're going to get that filled up. Um, there's a couple deep scratches that are in here. A couple of the other ones. You can see slightly, but I mean, you see what that does for you. I mean, all of this tiny, tiny, this was all scratched up. I mean, all of it down here and all of those seem to be gone now is mostly paint, but we do have a stubborn one here. It's pretty big. So we're going to get epoxy for that. And uh, he's going to work on that over the weekend um, and, uh, and get it together. And we're going to stop back, see how it went. Anyways, guys. There's still more work to do, so he's going to work on it this weekend, and then uh, I'm going to come back, and uh, I'm going to wrap it up right now, but we'll be back with it when it gets done and everything. I'll do another video so you can check it out, see how it came out. Later.